Hello, my name is David Sanchez. I'm a senior program manager in the Azure Maps team. In this session, I'm going to cover Azure Maps Creator to leverage indoor mapping capabilities into your applications. As part of the agenda of this session, I'm going to do an introduction of Azure Maps, cover what is Azure Maps Creator. I'm going to talk about the creator capabilities and roadmap. I'm going to do a deep dive on Azure Maps Creator. I'm going to share some resources with you. And of course, we're going to do a demo. Every company is a software company, and almost every application needs location capabilities. Could be for search and address, validate an address, get the IP location, or just embed a map control into the application, or other use cases that we are going to explore in this session. Microsoft has been working with mapping for over 20 years. These are some of the products and services that are powered by the Bing Maps on the consumer side and Azure Maps on the enterprise side. Even the Microsoft Flight Simulator is being powered by the Microsoft Mapping Services. But what is Azure Maps? Azure Maps is a set of geolocation APIs that enables developers like you to embed geolocation capabilities and geolocation intelligence into your applications. Azure Maps is built on top of strong partnerships with companies like TomTom or AccuWeather to bring the features and the services that you need for your applications. So now let's explore some of the features and capabilities that you can get as part of the Azure Maps. First, we have the map rendering control. This allows you to get satellite images and map images into your applications. Next, we have the SDKs. We have the web and mobile SDKs to integrate your Azure Maps into your applications. Also, you can get routing. From a multi-algorithm routing, could be through batch routing and max routing, or even just get one point to another. Next, we have search. This service provides you to find capabilities to look for address, point of interest, or just look for multiple addresses in a batch. We also have special operations to create your fencing, measuring distance between points, or even leverage polygon points. Next, you can get real-time traffic flow that is updated every minute, and it provides you incident details. If you need to get the time zone by some specific location, you can do that through Azure Maps. If you need to get the IP location, you can use the geolocation service to get location from users through the IPs. Weather service is one of the services that we announced GA last month, and you can get not only historical data and the current data, but also the forecast for up to 45 days. Next, we have the elevation service. This has pole-to-pole -pole coverage. You can get different kind of elevations, could be in a route or some specific part of the map. And last but not least, we have the Power BI integration. Actually, if you are using Power BI, you are an existing customer of Azure Maps. But this session is about Azure Maps Creator. So what is Azure Maps Creator? This service provides the capability to secure and scale your private indoor map data. Through map provision services, you can create, host, edit, and modify what you need from your CAD files which are provided by your engineering or architectural team to host it in Azure Maps. We also have the map utilization service. This service provides you the rendering and rich visualization of the indoor maps that you have. You can also get feature state. This will provide the integration with IoT solutions to visualize the devices and sensors that you have in your building. We also have the Spatial Data Querying API, which is based on the Open Geospatial Consortium standards. And last but not least, you also have the developer tools for indoor maps, floor picker, and the integration of indoor with outdoor capabilities. But before continue talking about other Azure Maps Creator, I'm excited to announce the general availability of Azure Maps Creator. You can read more about this announcement in the link that I'm sharing in the video. So what are the capabilities that you can get as part of Azure Maps? As I said before, you can leverage the Azure Maps services into your Azure Maps Creator account. 
So you get your own private maps in Azure integrated with the maps control and the SDKs. Also, you can use the routing and search capabilities, which will happen post the general availability. And last but not least, we also have the integration with Power BI to visualize indoor mapping in your dashboards and reports in Power BI. And also, we have the smart building solutions. During the past years, most industries have been working harder on the COVID challenge, from keeping workers safe managing logistics, and constantly evolving guidelines through acceleration of the automation and monitoring for buildings and different solutions. The role of creator in such a time has been crucial and stretched the original design goal in order to be applied with different variety of technologies in many industries. For energy management, space utilization, or even provide a better occupant experience, measuring social distance, face mask, and so on. This can help many facility management teams to operate more efficient the energy in the buildings. These are some of the supported smart building solution experience. You can have indoor map data management, live map visualization, and you can get also occupant experience. To find a room, get who is assigned to each office, book a table in a restaurant, book a seat in an airplane, or book a seat in a movie theater. Here are other use cases for smart building solutions. As I mentioned before, this is a great use for facility managers to query the capability of the meeting rooms, and this will rely on a IoT data to get the sensors data and the devices that are on each room. We also have asset tracking to provide tracking of devices and define monitor geofences in your buildings. This can help you to trigger business logic, for example, in a laboratory or in a meeting room. We are working on a feature to provide users search and also routing indoor mapping. This will happen fast the general availability. It's a feature called wayfinding, and it can help you to provide users what is the fastest route to one point to another. You can also leverage Azure Maps services as part of the integration with Azure Maps Creator. One example of this is the weather service. This can provide the weather forecast to improve the energy efficient. For example, if it is cold outside, there is no need to run the air conditioner system in the building, so it can automatically turn off. Now, let's do a deep dive on how the indoor mapping provisioning service works. First, we have the drawing package. The drawing package is uploaded through the data service. This will execute a conversion using the conversion service. It will store it in a validated block with the schemas and the conversion file. Next, you can create the data set service. This will store a copy of your record. And next, you can leverage the tile set service. This will use the tiles for rendering as long as the feature state service to get runtime map properties, such as if the room is busy, it's free, it's book, and so on. In the backend, this will run cloud services to provide the different APIs and services that you need as part of your indoor mapping. When we talk about the consumption services, you can use the OGC feature API to access the data set. You can access the render API to render map controls. You can use the search to look for a room. You can use the route API to get the route from one point to another. And also you can use the feature state API to get data from the different devices, such as occupancy, temperature, and so on. This solution can integrate with Azure Digital Twins. Azure Maps Creator provides the visualization of the different devices that are connected to the digital twins such as thermostatus sensors, occupancy sensors, and it can trigger also alerts based on your business logic. Now let's do a demo of a live map visualization. So here we have the Azure map. As you can see, it's like any other map control that we are seeing. The only difference is if I zoom in, in the Microsoft campus, I will be able to see the indoor mapping 
using my private map data. This is one of the buildings that we have in the campus. And from here, you can see, for example, we have an alert. This is an alarm that a back door is open in this building. I can select a room and I can get the information of this room. Also, I can get the temperature outside the building and I can navigate through the different floors. As part of the configuration that I have for this solution, I have the integration with IoT sensors to get the temperature of each room. So I can customize the style using the temperature that I have in this table. Also, I can enable the weather outside the building. So now I am getting the real-time weather service and I can enable the occupancy as well. I can set up custom alerts based on occupancy, temperature, or even the weather outside the building. And I can do this for other buildings in the same region or even in different countries. Last but not least, I'd like to share with you the Azure Maps code samples. These are almost all the features that we have available in Azure Maps. You can take a look at the animations, map controls, routing, search, and more. Actually, if I look for creator here, I will see a demo right here. You can run this sample in the browser, or you can take a look at the source code. This will redirect you to GitHub. This demo is open source, and you can access it through GitHub in the link that I'm sharing in the presentation. It is a very complete scenario where you have integrated not only IoT, but also Azure Maps Creator to visualize the different sensors and data coming from those devices. Next, I'd like to share some of the resources we have available in case you want to get started with Azure Maps and Azure Maps Creator right now. Here, you can find the blog, you can find the tech blog, you can find sample demos, and you can also find other content like videos or customer stories. Thank you very much for your attention and for watching. I'm looking forward to see what you are building using Azure Maps Creator.